everybody, if you do ask me about the screen size of the new Switch 2 uh, relative to the Switch 1, original Switch. So keep in mind, this is just estimations, yeah? Uh, we don't know the exact sizes. However, we do have an image that Nintendo posted, which I actually created kind of a, you know, overlay illustration on top of it in Photoshop to try to get a better understanding of the size difference between, relative size difference between the original Switch and the Nintendo Switch 2. Actually, what you see here. But I wanted to know the exact size, I mean, as much as I can, exact size, estimation. Uh, so what's the size, is it, uh, you know, uh, eight inches, eight point, uh, four inches as Sam says, even maybe it's less, where I need to calculate. Now, I'm not an expert in the field, but I tried my best to do it in Photoshop, and I'm gonna show you actually what I came up with. So Nintendo actually showed an image showing the new Nintendo Switch versus the uh, original one, uh, one uh, side of the other. So basically just overlay, uh, I just took only the viewable part of the screen, right? We wanted to actually see content, not the black borders, not the bezels, and just overlay a rectangle on top of it. So you can actually see it here. I mean, I'm just putting a rectangle on top of it, two rectangles, all right, on top of the images. It's just kind of overlaying them one on top of the other. Now the reason I'm showing the process is maybe I got it wrong, so, but I'm sharing. So basically I use measurement in Photoshop uh, in inches instead of pixel. Basically I can actually see the measurement if I use different things. So I know it's actually measured in inches and I'm measuring it from the top left corner to the, uh, sorry, from the, it doesn't matter, from the top left to the bottom right or from the top right to the bottom left, basically diagonal. And I actually uh, reduced the size to actually match the 6.2 inches, which is the size of the original Switch. So I actually verified it on the uh, Nintendo.com website. It says a multi-touch capacitive touch screen, 6.2 inch LCD screen, uh, 2080 uh, by 720 pixel resolution. So you can actually see the lamp there at the top, 6.235, anyway, 6.2, and this is in inches. So I just basically signed that uh, as a zone there. So this is basically the size. And then what I did, I just uh, took both of the squares and resized them all together to keep, of course, the relative, relative size. And just for the blue one, which represents the original switch to match that area. All right, so now it matches the area. I try to do this like by pixel perfect as much as I can, just even checking things out. Yeah, so even it was really not perfect, kind of aligned it. Okay, it won't would be going to be perfect. Anyway, we need to be kind of an estimation. And then I needed to measure the green uh, part, right? Uh, because this is the switch to uh, viewable screen size. Yeah, so I mean, I think you measure it from the top uh, left to anyway. I just, that's how I did it. So I actually put some limitations there uh, for the ruler and then I measured it and the measurements are like that. You can actually see it now, I enlarged it. So it's uh, 7.8, uh, anyway, it's not a 1% perfect, right? But it seems like it's uh, 7.8 inches based on my testing. That's as far as I go in terms of what I can do. Maybe I got it wrong, I maybe not, I don't know. But based on this test, that's the result, 7.8 inches. Yeah, I also measured from the other side, not that it matters. <laughs> but again, if you know more in the comment section below, this is based on this test. Just people ask me to do that, so I'm doing it here. Thanks for watching.